హలో ఫ్రెండ్స్ ఐ ఎమ్ శంషోద్దీన్ ఐ వెల్కమ్ యూ ఫినాన్షియల్ అకౌంటెంట్ క్లాసెస్ ఇన్ దిస్ క్లాస్ ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు సాల్వ్ ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ రిలేటింగ్ టు మోరండమ్ జాయింట్ వెంచర్ అకౌంట్ లెటెస్ రీడ్ ది ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఏ అండ్ బి ఎంటర్డ్ ఇన్ టు అ జాయింట్ వెంచర్ టు కన్స్ట్రక్ట్ అ బిల్డింగ్ ది కాంట్రాక్ట్ ప్రైస్ వాజ్ రూపీస్ టూ ల్యాక్ ది ప్రాఫిట్స్ ఆఫ్ ద జాయింట్ వెంచర్ వేర్ టు బి షేర్డ్ బై దెమ్ in the ratio of 3 is to 2 the following were the expenses incurred by them towards the same iron material a provided rupees 40000 and b provided 21000 wages paid by a 30000 and b 17000 cement provided by a 19000 and b rupees 11000 architect fees paid by a 5000 plant supplied by b costing rupees 20000 sundry materials supplied by b 7000 the contract price was duly received by a the plant was taken back by b subject to 50% depreciation write up memorandum of joint venture account in this problem both of the co-venturers have incurred items required for this particular construction business and b has provided plant we have to charge depreciation 50 percentage on the value of rupees 20000 the contract price rupees 2 lakh which is received by a so based on this information let us prepare the memorandum joint venture account first we will take the expenditure incurred by a first we will take the items of expenditure made by a a's account so a has provided iron material iron material costing rupees 40000 and wages and spent rupees 30000 for wages and provided cement costing rupees 19000 and paid architect fees architects fees rupees 5000 total amount rupees 94000 here a has spent for this business 94000 rupees at the same time b has incurred expenditure as well as provided material so first is iron material he also provided iron materials costing rupees 21000 and and paid wages rupees 17000 and incurred for cement rupees 11000 and brought plant costing rupees rupees 20000 and provided sundry material sundry materials costing rupees 7000 so the total is rupees 76000 mr b has incurred for this business rupees 76000 the contract price received by a so contract price received by a means a's account it is contract price contract price received received by a rupees 2 lakhs and the plant provided by b which is subject to depreciation b's account b's account here 
the total cost of plant cost of plant rupees 20000 this is charge depreciation 50% means 10000 remaining 10000 must be taken these account it is plant at the end at the end then there is no other items let us close this account the total of credit side total of credit side rupees two lakh ten thousand two lakh ten thousand same must be written debit side two lakh ten thousand and find out profit or loss profit or loss in this case credit side is greater than the debit side the difference is rupees 40,000 which is termed as profit it is profit it must be distributed among both the partners A's account and B's account so A's account B's account 40,000 it must be distributed in their profit sharing ratio their profit sharing ratio is 3 is to 2 means 3 by 5 and 2 by 5 it is 24,000 for A and 16,000 for B in this way memorandum joint account is prepared after preparation of memorandum joint venture account let us prepare joint venture account in the books of a in this account only we have to take the transactions pertaining to a so whatever the transactions made by a that must be debited to this account either with cash or bank account in this problem a has incurred amount for iron material so that will be taken here debit side 40,000 and he has incurred for wages that is also cash or bank he has incurred for wages it is rupees 30,000 and he has incurred for cement that is also taken cement it is rupees 19,000 and he has paid for architect fees architect fee architects fees rupees 5000 and profit belongs to a profit and loss account it is profit rupees 24000 in this problem a has received a contract price that is cash or bank account this is contract price contract price received by a it is 2 lakh it means that a has received contract price of rupees 2 lakh it must be returned to b a portion pertaining to b this account must be closed by taking total credit side and same should be written debit side and find out the differences the difference will be 82,000. 
this is balance balance carry down or we can say brought forward why it is taken balance carry down or brought forward because in this problem the information is not given as the accounts are duly settled after preparation of joint venture in the books of a let us prepare in the books of b joint venture account with a in this account all transactions relating to b must be taken to debit side cash or bank account he brought iron material he brought iron material for rupees 21000 and also he paid for wages he paid for wages rupees 17000 and also he paid for cement he paid for cement rupees 11000 and brought plant costing rupees 20000 it is plant and paid for sundry materials sundry materials it is rupees 7000 and profit pertaining to b profit and loss account loss account it is profit it is 16000 and he took the plant and machinery plant and machinery or plant account plant account taken over here total cost of plant is 20000 minus 50% of depreciation so it becomes 10000 and finally this amount is carried down because there is no information with regard to the accounts settled 92000 will take 92000 the difference will be 82000 this is balance balance carried down or we can say brought forward in this way books of accounts are maintained thank you jai hind